Everyone loves Christmas. Why? Because it's all about love and spending time with your family. The biggest blessing anyone could ever ask for. Sorry about that. I accidentally used the clips for the bullshit Christmas lies. The real reason everyone loves Christmas is because of gifts, nigga. I said it. I'm tired of all the lies. Y'all know it's true. When you ask someone what they want for Christmas and they say some dumb shit like, you don't have to get me anything. I appreciate you. Then you go out of your way to go get them some socks because you had no idea what they wanted. Then they have the nerve to look at you with a fake ass smile knowing deep down they're burning with rage inside. Because socks, nigga? You got me socks? What the fuck am I supposed to do with a pair of fucking socks? Man, I oughta slap the f No cap though, if you ever got anyone a pair of socks for Christmas, you're a terrible person and you deserve cold, soggy fries for the rest of your life. Yes, I went there because you're a piece of shit. Now with all that being said, yes, my favorite holiday growing up was definitely Christmas, but only because of the gifts, again, free gifts and i could honestly say back in the day around the age of eight or nine my parents were still together and it wasn't like we were rich or anything but my parents definitely did everything in their power to make sure we had a good christmas and when i tell you this particular year the gifts under the christmas tree looked real nice no kizzy and when my parents asked me for my christmas list i had about 15 things on a motherfucking christmas list so i think it was safe to say that this year was about to be turned all the way up Except, there was one problem. There were still about five days left before Christmas morning. How the fuck am I supposed to wait five whole days to open up my gifts? That's practically impossible to ask of a nine-year-old why. I needed my toys, and I needed them now. Or at the very least, I at least needed to know that I got everything I wanted on my Christmas list, so I couldn't wait. That night, I had a plan. Our bedtime was usually around like 10 p.m., but because I would normally sneak out around midnight for snacks, I knew that no later than 12.30, both of my parents would be completely knocked. And honestly, it wasn't that hard to tell because my dad literally had one of the loudest snores in the fucking world. No exaggeration. I'm so sorry that you had to deal with that, Mom. Nonetheless, Christmas was coming early this year. So that night, I walked into the living room, and there it was. Stand right back at me. a child's dream really come true. A Christmas tree full of gifts and a whole lot of ones with my name on. Now I came to terms with the fact that I couldn't just take my gifts early because I would get caught for sure. Even my dumbass at that age was smart enough to know that. So I settled for at least knowing what I got. So the plan was I was gonna poke a tiny hole in all of my gifts, then tape it back. No one would even notice. It was just a small hole. And then on Christmas morning, pretend to be surprised about what I got. But I really knew all along. Why do kids even think this way? It just, it's pointless. So I'm going through my gifts, and after the fourth to fifth one, I started to become very frustrated. Because all my shit sucked. I think by the eighth gift, the best one I had was a Beyblade. Which was cool if I didn't already have 20 of them motherfuckers. This was panning out to be the worst Christmas ever. My ungrateful ass didn't get anything I asked for. There was only one box left. I almost didn't even open it because I've already been so disappointed. But, gots to see it through, my boy. I pick up the gift and this one felt different. The box was a little bit heavier than I expected. Almost as if something expensive was inside the gift. I'm starting to feel the excitement build up on the inside. This was it. The best for last. I poked a little hold on the side of the wrapping paper. And I didn't need to see anything else. I saw the letter P. It was a fucking PlayStation 2. This made it all worth it. This was the one gift on my list that I needed to be on there. A PlayStation 2. I was turned all the way up. So I still had five more days to wait before I was even able to play this thing. But now that was okay because I knew this was about to be the best Christmas of my entire life. I went back to my room and went to sleep with the biggest smile on my little spoiled brat face. Over the next few days, it felt like every 24 hours in a day felt like an entire week for each day. I'm sure y'all know the feeling. I think my mom could tell something was up, but she didn't know exactly what was going on. I did my best to try to keep my cool around her, but I was anxious. The anticipation about opening the PlayStation was killing me. So fast forward and it's finally Christmas morning, and you already know what type of time I'm on. Christmas breakfast 
Yeah, yeah. Let's hurry this up. Y'all ready to open presents? Quality time with the family cracking jokes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's hurry this up. Y'all ready to open the presents? It's time to open the presents. Yo, let's hurry this up. Y'all ready to open the presents? Yo, we're waiting on you. Oh, my bad. First up was my youngest brother, Waylon. He opened up his gift. He got a sweater from grandma. It was nice. He was happy. Next. Then it was my other brother, Wesley. He opened his gift. He got socks from grandpa. Damn, you down bad. Next. <laughs> it was finally time. I already knew what all my gifts were. And y'all already know which one I was going for. Nothing else mattered. I'm opening up the PlayStation. I grabbed the box. Why, you don't want to start with one of the smaller boxes? <laughs> nah, nah. I got a good feeling about this one. Why, I think you should start with Mom, I'm good. Please, just let me open this one. It was finally time. The day I've been waiting for. I'm finally about to open my very first PlayStation. Why is there a hole in all of Wyatt's gifts? What did you just say? What, what do you mean? Yeah, look, there's like a hole in all of his gifts. And someone tried to tape it back up. You little over-observant little annoying nuisance. Why the hell did you say that? Why? There was no reason for you to say that. Why? Don't you dare let me find out you opened your gifts early. Now here's the thing. All the evidence is stacked against me. I went straight for the best gift. And from the look of my mom's face, I can tell she definitely knew that I was up to something. And what do you think I did? You see, Mom, I saw that Santa didn't wrap the gifts properly, so I figured I would just take them shut and keep, this, keep the gifts a secret. She got roped, she knew I was lying, and she beat my ass Christmas morning. In front of the entire family. And the worst part is, she took all my gifts to an orphanage, and she made me watch other kids Open my presents. My PlayStation was in the hands of some random kid. The only thing I got for Christmas that year was an ass whooping and a lesson that stuck with me for the rest of my life. Merry Christmas, y'all, and a happy new year or whatever.